Hello everyone, this is Easy Electric. Do you happen to have an air purifier at home? Nowadays, because of the rising need, people are getting interested in air purifiers that filter fine dust, most allergens and varieties of viruses including the deadly novel coronavirus 19. Today's best product is air purifier. So let's talk about this electric air purifier now. An air purifier was invented just recently. As you know, it was not vital to use this device since our air was still clean back then. However, over a period of time, our air got so polluted because of the rising industries, coal mining and other commercial and industrial factories that emit toxic gases in our environment. Our air has become severely polluted that in 1799, Alexander von Humboldt a German scientist invented a gas mask that can filter harmful gases. A gas mask is a breathing device that one should put on their face to filter harmful gases. However, this cannot make our air clean. As industrialization continues to progress, the condition of our air continues to regress. So then, the first electric purifier was created by Professor Frederick Gardner Cottrell. This device uses an electrostatic precipitator. Let me go on further. It's visualized through 3D animation about the theory of electrostatic precipitation. As a discharge phenomenon occurs, ionization occurs in the air that becomes positive or negative polarity. The air has positive or negative polarity. Therefore, thus that joins the air has a negative and positive polarity as well. Now we must draw that they are positively and negatively charged. This act of extraction is called dust collection. In an air purifier, there are electrodes installed in it. The positive and the negative electrodes. The positive electrode attracts negatively charged particles. The negative electrode attracts positively charged particles. So the dust that comes inside the air purifier negatively or positively charged, is attracted by the electrodes and thereby being trapped inside. The air that is free from the electrical charges is then released back to the environment as a clean air. The air now has been cleaned and purified. This process of cleaning the air through this device is called electrostatic precipitating or simply air purifying. Hence, the device is called an electrostatic precipitator or simple air purifier. I already mentioned some important technical terms like electrical insulator, electrostatic discharge, and ionization. Please be reminded of those things. The air purifier has two general types, the filter type and the electrical type. Electric air purifiers are commonly available for industrial use. Industries and factories usually emit large quantities of pollutants. If they use the filter type of purifier, it will be worn out easily. To ensure the efficacy of such purifier type, its filter should be replaced very often. This is a very challenging and tedious task, especially in the case of huge factories and industries that use large-scale filter types purifiers. Before we end this video, I have an important note to leave. There is always something that professors who are researchers in air quality or air itself always say. The best air purifier are in using filters or electric machines, but open windows first. It will be best to use an air purifier after measuring the fine dust concentration and ventilating at an appropriate time. Thank you.